It is tonight, guys. Hey, guys, welcome back to the interviews. And today we are back with our final video before The Walking Dead season eight premieres tonight in just a couple of hours. Now, I'm very sorry I couldn't get this video up. Uh, you know, you know, a, you know, earlier on in the day, I had tons of stuff to do. Did not get around to doing a video, but I could not skip it. I mean, I mean, it's it's a huge day for The Walking Dead. So tonight is the night. So I'm just going to talk about my expectations a little bit for the season premiere. You guys can write yours below before the episode starts because the season finale of uh, season 7 is going to be coming on really soon. So, and you know, we're getting really close. So, really, really excited. Now I am going to watch the season 7 finale again actually on cable, you know, before. And I, I was also watching some season 7 there, uh, you know, uh, earlier on today just because I love season 7. Uh, and you know, at least those last few episodes are really good. So. I was watching some season 7 a little bit. Now, I want to also talk about one more thing before The Walking Dead tonight. Uh, this has nothing to do with The Walking Dead tonight, but just wanted to talk about it. Um, I did actually get the hardcover for the Here's Negan uh, comic, so this is cool. I will review this probably at some point in time this week, but with The Walking Dead coming back, I it's, it's going to be difficult because uh, I'm going to have tons of TV show videos to do, you know, so... Um, yeah, that that, uh, that that's the side the yeah, point. But anyway, really excited for tonight's episode, guys. Uh, you guys can write your comments below on what you're expecting. Here's how I think the episode's probably going to go in general. Um, I think that we'll probably get the first half of the episode being them, the speeches, uh, leading the, the walkers to the sanctuary, even though it could get wrapped up pretty quick. Putting the uh, the arm color things or whatever, getting that all set up. You gotta have a good few minutes of that, and then you're gonna get into the action. You're gonna see the the battle at the sanctuary. I'm guessing, um, or at an outpost. You know, it's it's very uh, tricky to say. But then we're gonna probably see the walkers, you know, close in and you know uh, overrun the sanctuary. I'm guessing, and then the savior is gonna be trapped, and then Rick's group are probably going to flee and leave. And they're going to go attack some other outposts. Now, whether or not we see the attacks on the outpost is a good question. I would lead towards the episode would probably end before we get to that point. But we could see Rick get captured by Jadis maybe at the end of this episode. Is something I think we uh, we got to kind of think about real quick. So, there's a lot of stuff that you know we're not really sure of. But I'm very, very excited. I, I can't be more excited for this episode. Um... You know, when it comes to Season 7, a lot of people did not enjoy it. I think, personally, that Season 8 is going to be 10 times what Season 7 was. I think Season 8 will probably beat out, like, Season 5. Probably, I don't know if it will beat out Season 6. We'll have to see when we actually see the full season um, itself. But I'm pretty sure that it's going to be one of the best seasons of The Walking Dead television show overall as an entire series it's it, i have a good feeling about it it's just with the trailers the trailers look great uh, look great uh the season looks great whatever they they've been showing has been looking really really great and i don't know why so many people are not as excited as they usually are but i will have to say though that a lot of people probably don't know this scott gimple said that the first four episodes are going to be amazing this is the thing I'm kind of wondering. Is episode 5, 6, 7, 8, you know, and etc. going to be uh, less exciting? You know, because I think, honestly, you should keep that all-out war excitement that you get in the comics the whole season long. I know that's difficult to do, but really, you need to do that. So I hope that they don't... It's like the first four episodes are great, and then 5, 6, it's like, eh, I, I don't know how I feel about this. I hope it doesn't get like that. Um... But I'm pretty sure with The Walking Dead, we've had that in Season 7. I don't think they're going to repeat themselves again, uh, you know. So, um, definitely, though, I'm expecting big stuff tonight. Um, also, some tie-ins from, you know, the first season. You know, they, they've been doing a lot of that. So, I'm expecting to see a little bit of that tonight as well. Um, maybe Carl running into Sadiq in this episode would be another quick sequence we could see. Uh, maybe we'll see Michonne and Rosita out there as well, because we've seen that them two are out on their own. So... There's a lot of stuff tonight that we'll probably see, so it's very tricky, but that's what I think we're going to see for the episode. Uh, the rest, like, there's some stuff I think they'll leave for, you know, the following episodes, like um, the satellite station attack, I don't think we'll see that. I don't think we'll see the scene where Rick's jumping into the jeep and the Jada scenes and all that. I don't think we'll see all those, but I think the sanctuary, zombie leading, 
um, you know, Rick waking up at the end of the trailer scenes. I think that, and the Sadiq and Carl scenes, I think that will probably be what happens in this episode, to be honest. So, um, you know, it's, you know, it's very tricky to say what is going to be in this episode exactly. We'll have to watch it to find out, but I'm super excited. Uh, I hope you guys are as well, and I'm going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoy it. Enjoy the episode tonight, guys. Seriously, enjoy it. And after the episode, we're going to do tons of discussions. And I'm actually going to try to, if I can get enough questions from you guys, do a Q&A every week for The Walking Dead, uh, you know, um, you know, every week. You know, every week you can write a, a question, questions, whatever, and I'll answer them in a Q&A video every week. Maybe I'll do them on a specific, uh, specific day or something. So, because I want to start a new system like that. So, um, anyway, guys, make sure to write your comments below. Enjoy the episode tonight, guys, and I will see you guys tomorrow for my review. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, happy watching, guys. I'll see you guys really soon. Peace.